What's good YouTube, Ben here, welcome to the next video on the channel. In this one, I'm going to teach you how to format a hard drive or a drive in this part, and then how to create a new partition. Let's get into this. Hey guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe please, because they really do help me to get found. Don't forget to turn on notifications to be notified of all uploads and live streams, and don't forget to join me on my socials. Those are linked down below. Okay, let's get in. So before we go any further into the video, I want to point out that this can be very dangerous if you do not know which drive it is you're trying to format, because you could accidentally format the drive that contains your operating system. So I'm giving you fair warning, if you mess this up, I don't want anyone in the comments blaming me, because I gave you fair warning that this could happen if you do it something by accident, okay? So please make sure you are very careful when doing this. So, assuming you're up for it, let's jump in. So, you want to open up Command Prompt as Administrator. Once it's open as Administrator, you want to type in Disk Part. So, it'll take a minute to load. And whilst that takes a minute to load, I've also got Disk Management open. Now, you may be wondering why I'm not using Disk Management for this instead of, you know, instead of, like, you know, that. Well, <sighs> Disk Management, whilst it has a basic... Um, formatting utility tool it's not as good as this part not to mention a lot of people would use this part if they have issues with a SD card hard drive whatever this part can fully clean things very quickly and it does a proper job whereas disk management kind of half asses that job but this is what I'm going to show you so I'm going to keep this open because this too is the one we're looking at so this is a 32 gigabyte um, SD card I've got plugged into a USB adapter. This will work with hard drives as well and SSDs, but I'm using a removable device for this because I need to I need to format it anyway. So once you know which drive it is, so you want to hit list disk in this part, and this will list all the disks that are currently available to the system. So I have disk zero, disk one, and disk two. Now, disk zero I know is a four terabyte drive because it's three, seven, two, six gigabytes. Now just remember that if you've got like a one terabyte drive uh, in disk part, it's not gonna show as one terabyte. It never does because there are always parts of it that can't be used. So we know that this is four terabytes because it's almost 4,000 gigabytes. We know that disk one is a terabyte drive because it's 953. And I know that disk two is my 32 gigabyte removable media. So in my case, I'm going to be using disk 2, but obviously you want to make sure you're picking the right disk for you. It could be disk 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, blah, blah, blah. You get the drill. Once you know which one you're using, you type it. So in my case, it's um, SEL disk 2. So disk 2 is now the selected disk. And once you are fully sure that this is the one you want to wipe, you want to type in clean. And hit enter and that will clean that hard drive completely and it's good that we're keeping this open because as you can see this is now unallocated space this part has completely wiped this drive in fact deleted all partitions from it so now that the partition has been completely redone what you want to do is you want to create a new partition so for this all you want to do is type in create partition primary and as soon as you hit that yeah oh, sorry did I type it in wrong yes I did create petition primary <laughs> I spelt partition wrong that was my bad and there we go. Now it's just successfully created the new partition. And if you give it a minute, it will automatically assign a new letter to that drive. Of course, you could just assign a letter yourself if you want, I guess. In which case, you'd be like, assign letter, I think it's equals Z. And there we go. Now we've just assigned it a new letter. So let me know what you thought about this tutorial in the comments down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, please. Uh, oh, yeah, uh, quickly before that as well. Once you assign a new letter, um, Windows File Explorer might pop up. 
and ask you to if this is like removal media this will happen with it um, it'll pop up asking you to do a quick format of the drive again once you've assigned a letter so once the letter has been assigned then it will ask you to do a quick format it's fine because then it'll keep the partition it'll keep the letter like I said don't forget to comment like and subscribe don't forget to turn on notifications because I do live stream most days and I upload daily and don't forget to join me on my socials those are all linked down below and I'll catch you guys in the next